to a marijuana mystery at a Boston radio station. The drug task force was called to 96.9 when workers opened a shipment that no one was expecting. A box delivered to the station and in it, 30 pounds of pot. Mm. The station turned that package over to police. So now they're trying to track down where it came from and who was supposed to get that package. WBZ's Louisa Moeller has the story all new at 5. Um, wow. What's that? <laughs> she gave me the eye emojis like this, like, oh my God. Radio personality Ramiro normally saves his antics for the airwaves. But on Tuesday, the co host of the 969 Get Up crew couldn't help but notice some hubbub. You know, the frantic commotion, the footsteps. He followed the frenzy down to the station mailroom. No one's ever in the mailroom. <laughs> and there was kind of like a group of people. You could tell they were surrounding and looking at something, and they were kind of talking. I couldn't tell what they were talking about. Where he saw a box. Maybe like two of these? But not just any. I'm no expert, but it looked like Northern Lights Cannabis Indica. Translation, pot. 30 pounds of pot wrapped up so tightly that it sat there for weeks until someone sniffed out what was inside. He snapped a pic. It was like super, super tightly sealed. The rumors have been swirling about how the weed got here, who it was addressed to, and where it came from. The Boston police say it wasn't addressed to anyone here. Now it's in the hands of the state lab for testing. But that's not stopping Ramiro and his crew from pointing fingers. Yeah. He doesn't work in the mailroom, just so you know. <laughs> and poking some fun. If I see somebody who looks a little nervous, a little extra sweaty, a little mad, I'm going to pull them aside and tell them, tell them to tell me the story. In Dorchester, Louisa Moeller, WBZ News.